Hello, Roger Bisbee here from Skill Builder. That's a YouTube channel and also a website where we deal with all kinds of things which are of interest to the building industry. We do power tool reviews, we do how to's, all sorts of things. So if you wanna know what we're about, have a look at that. We're gonna put the link up. And I just wanna have a little chat with you about something that dropped into my inbox last week. And I thought, wow, oh, that looks interesting, first glance and then I had another closer look at it. So I'd just like to know what you think about it really. And it was from Metabo and the press release was about the cordless alliance system. Now this is the Metabo lithium ion heavy duty battery system, their new system where they've increased the power of the batteries, even though they're just 18 volt batteries, they've managed to increase the power of them by putting in a larger cell. So that means they're now capable of running things like angle grinders and cordless saws and all the rest of it. So what they've done with this is they've rolled it out across a lot of different tools. And not only their own tools, but tools from other manufacturers. So I thought, oh, this is great. This looks like we might be moving towards a universal battery platform whereby you buy one system, you buy one particular manufacturer's batteries and then you can run a whole load of tools off it. Now who have they got in there? It's a bit of a German club, it's a bit of a cosy German club I'd say in, in as much as they got Maffel in there. They've also got Rothenberger in there, they've got Edenstock in there, Starmix who make the dust extraction systems and they've also got Hargo there and they've got Rothenberger who make plumbing tools and they've got Steinl who do as hot air guns that kind of thing for roof welding and they've got collar mix who are, they make plaster whisks and things like that. So none of those are really directly competing with each other. So as far as Metabo is concerned, okay, you could look at Maffel and say that, you know, from the cordless saw point of view, they're treading on each other's tools, but you know, Maffel is pretty high end stuff. So nice idea. They've got this lithium ion battery, which they're looking for things to do with, and they reckon they can get 1,800 watts out of it on an 18 volt battery with 10 cells. That's pretty good going. And it means, as I say, that they can run all these heavy duty machines. So they're really working towards what they call the cordless site. They don't want to see any mains power on that site at all. And of course, a lot of people agree with that because if you go on some sites, you can't run cables across. You're not allowed to run anything in the UK unless it's 110, which means you've got to have a transformer. So setting yourself up with cordless would seem to be the way to go. And the scene the market is certainly agreeing with them. But I'm just kind of interested to know what you think, whether you think that we need a universal battery platform across all manufacturers. Wouldn't that be great if we could move towards that? Or whether you wouldn't be tempted to go into uh, buying the Metabo system just to give you that universal thing across those different battery platforms. Now the other interesting thing about this is Metabo was bought by Hitachi who are now Hikoki. So that's Japanese. So either is Hitachi in there? Is Hitachi part of a cordless alliance system? Not at the moment they're not. So whether that's ever going to change, who knows? So what we could be looking at is something which promises to do something wonderful and actually just looks after a few German manufacturers who probably aren't very interested in making batteries for themselves anyway. But when you start looking at a lot of the other manufacturers, they're already very comfortable like Makita and so on with their battery systems and I can't really see him moving over. But anyway, tell me what you think. Come back and see us soon. And don't forget to have a look at the Skill Builder channel and our website because loads more on the building industry on there. I'm Roger Bisbee. Thanks very much for watching.